Hey friends! I cannot believe that it is already October. Today is October 3rd and I don't remember what it's like to talk to a camera. I haven't done it in so long. I feel like it's been forever since I've talked to you guys. I don't know, there's so many more things to talk about these days. I am running a original Tamagotchi. I don't know if I can get that to, ooh, yes. Uh, it was an impulse purchase from Target. I couldn't help myself. Um, the first time I let my friend Kate run it and um, unfortunately it died after about a week. So now I'm running it to see if I can get a character that will last a little bit longer. But it's October now, I cannot get over that. The seasons have changed. I'm wearing a sweater. It's so cold out. And I think it's time to run this. I have my Sanrio Smart 2, which I've been running. I finally, after about four months now, June, July, yeah, almost four months of running this have finally gotten all the Sanrio characters. I'm waiting for this battery to run out and then I'm switching over to my White Smart and I'm gonna run this with you guys while I chat about some other things that I, I wanted to talk to you about. So it's been a while since I've chatted with all of you. I think since the Tamagotchi On app was closing and since then a lot of things have happened. I have spent the last several weeks now, maybe even, no, it's, it's been a month. It's been a month since I started running this um, Digimon Vital Hero. I am loving this. Now, um, I spent the last couple of weeks making videos about this and the videos haven't been doing quite as well as all of my Tamagotchi content. And personally, I wasn't super surprised because I do know a lot of you are huge Tamagotchi fans and maybe don't care as much for Digimon but I encourage you to give this a shot or at least watch some videos about it because it's honestly very, very cool and I am enjoying it very much. One of my friends on here did mention that my videos about the Vital Hero haven't been getting a lot of views lately. I'll chat later with you about the status of my channel and what I think about the views and making content, but I'm gonna save that for later. Right now, I am getting ready for dinner with a couple of my really good friends. They are gonna be going to New York Comic Con this weekend, and I am sending them on a little mission for myself because I am obsessed, obsessed with the San Diego Comic Con shells that came out this summer for the P1 and P2 Tamagotchi. I will show you here, but they are like a comic book theme and I am absolutely in love with them. I have been stalking eBay for the last couple of weeks, hoping to get a like a decent deal. They are marked up like 50% or more on eBay and I, I just don't wanna pay those prices. I'm sending my friends on a little mission to get those Tamagotchis and whatever else they can get their hands on for me, but I have to make sure that I have enough cash here and then I actually have to bring it with me to the restaurant and give it to them in hopes that they will have time to get the Tamagotchi exclusives for me. Um, yeah, that's, that's where we're at. I will check in with you all later once I've got my Tamagotchi Smart set up and we'll talk a little bit about my channel and how things have been going for me. It's been a while since I vlogged in my car, but I'm a little early for my appointment, so I thought I would give you a little update on where I'm at with my Tamagotchis. I am now running three. I think I might get the secret character on this one, which I'm super excited about. I haven't done that in like three or four years now, and I'm really, really close, so I'm hoping it happens in the next couple of days. And then I have on my magic card, I got the ghost coochie pachi, which I was really hoping to get. I love him. I didn't realize he was going to be completely see-through. Look at that. And then on my Sanrio, I just have regular Weebchi. I think I'm going to switch over to the marine card on this. Once I'm done with this character, should be hopefully later today.
It is December 17th and I just had to turn on the heat for the first time. It is starting to get really cold. But look at the view out there. I am loving the fall foliage this year. My boyfriend did remind me though that it is getting towards the end of October and we're gonna have to put away all of our furniture from outside. We finally just started sitting outside and using it for the year and we already have to take it and put it in. Not really ready for it to be winter yet, but all the signs are here. It's, it's definitely coming. Hey, so it's actually been a couple weeks since I've started this vlog. And I don't know, I think I've been putting this conversation off for a little bit because it does require me to dive a little bit deep inside of me to figure out exactly what I'm trying to get out of this channel and what value I'm trying to provide to all of you. And I've been having a lot of, I've been having a hard time figuring that out for myself. So I spent all of September talking about this device here. It is called the Digimon Vital Hero. It is a fitness tracker that lets you raise Digimon. This thing is just so cool, I think, for someone like me and perhaps yourself, you're just kind of too busy to actually actively take care of a virtual pet. This you just wear on your wrist and you walk around and you exercise and the virtual pet evolves as you move. And I just think that is so cool. So I spent the whole month working with this and learning about it and how to use it. And I made a couple of videos about it and they did terrible. I think in the first couple of hours, I got maybe eight or nine views. And within a day or two, I only had a handful of views on these videos. And to me, that was honestly to be expected. A lot of you are here to watch my content about Tamagotchis and Digimon isn't really up there. Not all of my Digimon videos do really well. And so I was expecting that and I wasn't gonna get myself too upset about it, but someone commented saying that they didn't think I would make any more Digimon videos because the views were so low. Originally, when I started this channel back in 2020, it was during the pandemic, I got myself back into video editing when my friend started a YouTube channel and I realized that I just love videos and I love making videos and I love editing and I love the whole process, the scripting, the storytelling, the, the actual filming and learning how to use a camera, even down to the editing. I just love the entire process and I started a channel because I wanted to talk about all of the things that I love. Basically anything. The channel is named after me. I am Jill Grigas and the channel was supposed to be about me and the things that I like and, and helping me find people out in the world who enjoy all of the same things that I do. And over time that kind of evolved from, you know, doing a couple little vlogs, some video game videos, to talking about Tamagotchi. I mean, that's that's honestly one of my biggest, <laughs> I mean, my, my only collection right now is of Tamagotchis. I love them. I was obsessed with them as a child. When I found out that they were still in existence today in modern times, I was thrilled. My 13 year old self just came out and just had to have all of these Tamagotchis and talk about them with people who ever would listen. And so the, the direction of the channel ended up turning to Tamagotchis because I was interacting with all of you a lot more. I was getting a lot more views and that was exciting. And there was something thrilling about all of that. And I was just, I don't know, I just loved every second of it. But there is this part of me that's almost sad that um, the only thing that you guys know me for is Tamagotchi and that I'm not known for anything else. And that's partially my fault. I haven't really tried making videos about other things. I would like to make videos that tell really great stories and maybe have a theme. I have a lot of, I don't know, life experience that I'd like to share with those of you, especially those of you that are, are younger fans of Tamagotchi and, and share the things that I've learned in my life and maybe, you know, have some sort of impact on someone out there. That's really all I wanna do. I wanna make, I wanna help make someone's life better. And that's 
really what I want and that's not really where the channel is going at the moment. Um, I'm still making my Tamagotchi videos. I still really enjoy it. I love it actually. Like you can see it on my face. I just, I just absolutely love it. But I, I want more from it. I've been doing this now for two, almost two and a half years and I feel like I have a lot more to offer all of you and, and potential future viewers of the channel. And, and so this, one singular comment about getting low views really kind of sent my my brain on a spiral and so I, I haven't been posting as many videos because I'm trying to figure out what I want to do and how to direction the channel in a way that, that still satisfies me and my growth but also doesn't alienate any of you because I still love all of you. I'm so happy that you are my viewers, my friends, and I don't want you to go away because I happen to change my content or I kind of evolve in a different direction. I still plan to make Tamagotchi content. I have a whole bunch kind of like mapped out in my head um, and I still enjoy and really love it, but I will definitely be posting other types of content to see if I can catch anyone else's attention or kind of, you know, draw in some some new friends into our community. I don't know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to figure out how to do this. I'm gonna keep making content, whether it gets views or not. I just wanna, I don't know, feel like I'm progressing in my, my skill set and this journey of YouTube and learning more about how things work and how to tell a better story and how to engage all of you a little bit more and actually grow a community here and not just make a bunch of how-to videos and that you watch once and leave. I really want to engage all of you and, and get you to be part of my community and be truly my friends. So yeah, really the point of this is that I want to thank you for joining me on this adventure. I hope you stick around. And if you don't, I just, just know that I appreciated every moment that you were here and thank you. Oh, I almost missed it. I got my icon on the Marine card. So I have double of this character for the magic card and the marine card. And they are so cute. I'm trying to work, but it's lunchtime. So I'm watching Justine and hanging out with my Tamagotchis. This character, I thought I was gonna get the secret character, but I think, I think that's not gonna happen. It's day 10. So it kind of feels like it's not gonna happen. And I'm working on my magic and my marine cards. So that's where we're at right now. My two. Oh, I don't know how to say this character. So cute though. My Tamagotchi just got sick, which means it's possibly going to evolve into the secret character. Spoiler, I did not get the secret character. I did, however, get these. I'm so excited. <laughs>